Yes, I really need a haircut and a shave. I will do that tomorrow. My trimmer is uh, is um, charging, and it takes a whole day. Anyways, <coughs> I'm sorry. You know, catching a bit of cold. I just wanted to have a bit of talk, and that's something super exciting. And it's it's not nothing to do with my channel per se. Uh, it's more a personal talk about why I'm alive. I have um, created a Patreon page, or actually I have that Patreon page for quite some time, but I haven't used it. But I have updated it, and you can find it down in the description. That's the Patreon uh, link, and you can click on that to come to my Patreon page. There you can find several tiers, uh, where if you want to, you don't need to find uh, extra content where you can subscribe to monthly and you can um, support me so you can support me so I, so I can buy more gear so I can buy food so I can um, find a place to live because I'm homeless um, so I can get out in the world and create more content um, the stuff you'll see on the Patreon page is two things. I want to give you a more personalized view on who I am as a person, not the person you see on my YouTube channel, which is um, half drama, comedy, and um, half a try. I'm used to on my YouTube channel. I also try to help people like myself who are, have a hard time on finding out what they want to do in life with getting in contact with the creative side of themselves so they can get out into the world and show who they are and make money on it. I want to get people to become better at entrepreneurship and to filmmaking and to art or whatever they're into and get into the world so they can make money on what they are good at and what they want to do to do in life on the passions. Alright. You will not find that on my my uh, Patreon page. On my YouTube channel it's it's more a light version and on my Patreon page I'll go much more in depth in specific uh, details of the previous mentioned stuff. Not drama but helping people. So if you want some more in depth view on things, on how to make money on your YouTube channel and I'm not going to teach you how to grow on YouTube because I'm only myself as you can see just under 300 uh, subscribers but I'm not the right man for that but I can teach you how to make money on it, how to um, market yourself as a creative person and how to overcome mental stuff um, so you can grow, so you can start your own business. And um, besides that, I want to give you a more personal view of myself as who I am as a private person. Uh, so people have, have asked through the years, uh, if I always said I'm gonna be making videos on it, but I didn't think it was right for my main for my channel, my main channel. So I want to put it up on Patreon to those who really interested in those the personal stuff and the in-depth detail on growing and make money etc they can subscribe to, to our patreon it's uh, currently i think the lowest uh, tier is 25 dollars and up to i think it's 100 um it's a lot of money and you're not forced to do it i don't want you to sign up if you don't need the in depth details on how to make money uh, on YouTube uh, and um, what to avoid when making money on YouTube or on the internet in general and if you don't want to, to know more about me as a person then please don't use waste your money use no something else only sign up and support me if you want support to support me and get that extra content and being able to get in 
in contact with me to, to get more in-depth answers one-on-one -on -one or on um, group chats only on Patreon group lives. Alright, <clears throat> currently my situation now is that I'm We reached New Year's Eve this year, 23 slash 24. Then I've been uh, without a home for 10 years straight. I'm currently living on a friend's couch here and there. And then um, other times I sleep rough. But um, I am building up my own video production company and um, I'm saving up for some more quality equipment for that. So your money I'll make on Patreon and YouTube in the future. Then we go into that. And um, <clears throat> I have been thinking about getting an apartment but uh, it's not easy to just get an apartment. So I've also been thinking about getting an um, Simply saving money and buying a boat, not a big boat, but a boat with a little cabin, um, fishing boat, where, not a fishing fishing boat, but a fishing boat for anglers, uh, with a little cabin where I can sleep downside and in it and, and go fishing when I want to. I love fishing. Um, that's one thing. I could also um, save up the money and buy a little house. Now go up in Sweden, um, which is quite inexpensive, but the know will be longer away from our son and don't want to do that. So I think it's going to end up either with an apartment or um, a little boat. I have been thinking about buying a trailer and still putting it in on a, on a, on a camping site, but um, one, I don't have a, a car uh, to, to move it here and there. And, and, um, I think the renovations of buying a cheap trailer will be far more costly than having a, a, a boat fixing up, putting in the water, taking up once a year to clean the bottom and all that. So um, there's my thoughts and plans on that at the moment. I think we're going to end up with a boat, but let's see. Currently it's about to be become winter and um, my plan is to, to produce a lot of more content here on YouTube and to um, film. I'm a part of the Black Box Guild, which is um, helping videographers, cinematographers to put off their video clips into stock for the sites, which means if the, t if the television companies, something producers, want a clip or some YouTubers want a clip of some mountains or drone footage of the ocean then they go to Adobe Stock, Shutterstock, uh, Storyblocks, uh, Pond5 etc and buy that clip and then the site the buying into that will take a percentage and now I get some money and then the Black Box Guild will take a percentage and I get the rest of the money uh, and that's a way to, to sell video stock online, video clips online. So also use time on that, but that requires some new equipment. Um, and then I'm gonna start to prepare myself for eventually becoming, ending up on the street. I already have some stuff, but I need some, some sleeping bag, uh, some some equipment for for for, uh, for cooking, food, outdoors, uh, a smaller tent. Um, I already have a uh, fishing rod, I need some more fishing rods and some fishing gear then I'm actually just going to take a long fishing vacation by a lake, live there with the internet from my phone and uh, work online, uh, some solar charging and a power station, two power stations maybe and a cooler for the food which I can charge via the solar and so I can live outside on a longer camping camping thing outside vacation vacation is the word it's stressful but um let's go 
going to be fine. Soon it'll be Christmas. I celebrate Christmas, I don't know where. Maybe at my mom's place, but she doesn't know at the moment because she's, uh, she's sick, unfortunately. Not, it's not serious, serious, but she's sick, so it's, she doesn't know if she can uh, have guests on Christmas or New Year's Eve. And, uh, the family is going to another place, so I don't know if I can work with people then. So. At the moment, it, it looks like I'm, I'm going to think I'm, I'm going to leave Sweden and travel to Denmark, where I'm born. I'm Danish. Danish passport. And um, <clears throat> simply going back to my hoods, visiting the, the family grave. I like that. Give me peace to heart. Sitting by a lake, and hopefully, I have managed to get some. Sleeping equipment so I can sleep at the lake. I think it's beautiful. And fish at the same time. And if the, 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 the lake is closed or ice, then whatever. But I can sleep there, anyways. And then I'm also trying to get some more work as a video editor because I'm so super tired of, of um, writing articles. On casinos and stuff. It's good money, but it's so tiring and it's getting harder to find um, article customers because Upwork, where I've used so far, Upwork.com uh, has become more, way more expensive to, to use to find um, to find um, jobs, and um, they are way more now than before the coronavirus. And it's um, there's fewer jobs too, and they pay less. So it's, it's really not worth using, let's say, two hundred dollars to for applying for several jobs, and maybe get one or two, which pays three hundred fifty dollars, and then I have to to um, pay. 10% to the uh, Upwork website and, and, and or had to pay taxes too and and the time you used on that and the, the machinery and the software is not worth it. So um, until I save a lot of money together uh, so I can get started with the video production I will um, edit the videos I'm trying to get video um, editing jobs for YouTubers mainly so I can get some money flowing so that's the, the, the current update um, on me and my living situation and um, yeah. I could do some, some, some more outdoor stuff I like the outdoor stuff I, I'm tired of sitting in the chair and, and talking to a camera but it's easier when you only have a phone and the footage will be very shaky if I don't have the whole thing put up on as you should see my setup is glass ways glass ways with a candle on the back to hold the phone on the computer with standing on a stool it's yeah, pretty sad so um, I will use uh, do some more outdoor stuff because um, it just gives me more energy to be outside and to fish and to look for birds and photograph birds and look for, for mushrooms and filming mushrooms and being at the, at the water, at the, the, the woods and the beach in the mountains all mountains in Sweden, you don't have big big mountains but mountains yep. so you will start to see more content when want to say that I'm glad you follow me um, even if you do it because <laughs> you just want to see me rant over something on let's say 
strengthen that as general or suffer more that as general and giving my opinion on that or if you just want to see me talk about myself right now which I can't imagine anyone to do or if you're into the more money making side how to be creative online, how to do to overwhelm mental health problems then no matter what I'm, I'm happy for you that you're following me because it, it means a lot that someone are watching and not talking to an empty space I'm watching a beautiful sunset like sunset do you like sunsets? if you comment so far comment down below do you like sunsets or sunrises more let me know